Hey, this is SCXCR and I'm going to do something a little different. This is going to be a first impressions video. I'm not going to do a lot of these. I only do these with new games. And by new, I mean out of the wrapper games. In this case, I'm going to be doing it with Dead Rising Chop Till You Drop for the Wii. I've heard some mixed things about this one. For reference, I have played the first Dead Rising. And, come on, come on, I hate these things. Well, um, while I try and get this open, uh, I've heard uh, a lot of things about this, like how you can't jump and how there aren't that many zombies on the screen, but if you know me, you know that I don't like to judge things until I actually get my hands on a controller and play it. Okay. As you can see, I had House of the Dead overkill in here. It's a trippy game, but it's fun. Ah. Give me the disc. Ah. What I'm basically going to do is just play this for, I don't know, maybe 20 minutes, see what happens. Okay. Oh, I'm still on the shot. Good. <laughs> I woke up like that once. It's it's not that fun. F you, I'm gonna be a rebel. No wrist strap for me. Sure, why not? This game includes scenes of explicit violence and gore and is intended for audiences ages 17 and older. Wow. <laughs> Got to go. Okay, come on. Well, that's still the same. Let's keep it on normal. And I hate doing this whole pointing the camera at the TV thing, but this is the only way I can really do this. Okay, graphics definitely a step down from the 360 version, but I kind of expected that. What's this? It's a dog! I'm going to be killing something else at the shopping mall. What was that? The army? Yeah. Looks like taking a helicopter was the way to go. I bet they got all the roads blocked off by now. Alright, listen. I want to get shots of the whole town before the National Guard finishes blowing it off. Let me just fix Take something here. Okay. Oh, well, they skipped over that part. Hey! Can you get me on the rooftop of that mall? 
You gotta be kidding me. Man, you are nuts. I've gotta rescue the cast of Dawn of the Dead. Alright, listen. Don't forget to come back for me. As long as you're not dead, Fred. It's Frank. Frank West. Remember that name, because the whole world's gonna know it in three days when I get the suit. That's a huge bug! Oh shit, that's the launch codes! Check how the controls work with this, so this is gonna be pretty much an experiment. Hello there. Huh? I forgot how many cutscenes there were at the beginning of this. Yeah. Uh, you came along. Yeah, I'm freelance. You know, going to the battlefield alone, no crew. So, uh, what's going on around here anyway? came by helicopter, didn't you? What did you see from the sky? Well... This guy's not exactly very smart, is he? If it were just a riot, I doubt the military would quarantine the entire area. The moratorium on information getting out is a little... extreme, in my opinion. There's, uh, something else I can't put my finger on. Doesn't sound like civil disobedience. It's too quiet. <laughs> Almost as if everyone's already dead. Can you sense the yeah. foreshadowing in my voice? So why don't you just tell me already? What's going on? I think you'd better see for yourself. This, my friend. This is love. This is hell. Excuse me, I have to go back to my level so I can become a boss. Okay. Oh, well, it's definitely over the shoulder. Z and A to talk. Got the quick turn feature from RE4. It's a little weird that you have to hit two buttons at the same time just to do generic stuff. Yes, thank you. Okay, so it has to load to go into individual rooms. Definitely doesn't have the uh, free roaming feel of the original Dead Rising. Oh, come on. Not even RE4 had the load time after every single door. Do I? Nah. Oh, there we go. Ah, uh, yes, this scene. was gonna be this way sorry who 
looks like the bastard child of Joey and what's his name? Chandler from Friends. Venom! Apple. Cabbage? What the hell is this doing here? if I can actually get to any zombies before the space on the memory card on the camera runs out. Come on! <laughs> 